Hey, welcome back to Tech Talk. Uh, today's topic is what does a veterinary technician do? There's a lot of things that we do, so I'm just going to break it down, uh, kind of just what we do when we get here in the morning. So what we do first is we check in on any of the hospitalized patients, the ones that spent the night. Uh, we'll check their temperature, their pulse, and their respiratory rate. Uh, we'll take them out to go to the bathroom if they're able to. We change out any of the soiled bedding. We go ahead and give them any of the medications that they need. Uh, we feed and water them as well. Just get them ready so that they're comfortable for that day. And then after that, we get our exam rooms ready for the appointments that we're going to be seeing. And our surgical suite, we prep that and get that ready for surgical procedures. And then at that point, you're walking in the door. So then we come on up, we greet ourselves, um, or we greet you, I should say. And then we bring you on back for a check-in. So we, at that point, we ask you any questions that you're having, any concerns, any changes in your pet's routine. And then we go ahead and fill in the doctor that you're gonna be seeing and kind of fill them in on that history. And then we come on into the exam room together. Uh, our job during that time is just to restrain your pet, keep them on the table or on the floor, just in a comfortable position so it's easier for everybody. And then if there's any lab work that needs to be done, we go ahead and bring them on back. We collect the blood. Uh, urine, stool if needed, uh, we take the x-rays as well, and any nail trims or anal gland expressions that need to be done. And then we bring your pet on back to you and then we go ahead and run that lab work and we fill the doctor in on our findings and then they'll come into the room to go over that with you. And during that time is when we're filling any medications that need to be filled, we're getting any specialized food for you, um, and then we're just kind of getting some take-home instructions prepared. Then after that we come in, we go over all of that with you. We tell you how to give the medication, how often, if there's specialized instructions for you, we let you know about that. And if you have any additional questions at that time, that's when we answer those. And then after that, we bring you on up front um, to our receptionist desk so you can get checked out. And after that, you know, a couple days is usually when we do a call back for you just to check in on your pet to see how they're doing. After that, we go back and we clean the room and get ready for the next patient. Uh, if you're there for a surgical procedure, we go through a different check-in. That way, we answer any questions you might have about the procedure, any restrictions that you think your pet is going to need afterwards. And then we bring them on back. If they need blood work done before their procedure, we go ahead and collect that and run that. And then we get them prepped for their procedures. So we do the shaving, we do the prepping the surgical site, and then we monitor them while they're under anesthesia. So we're watching their heart rate, we're watching their blood pressure, making sure that they're breathing okay. And we just monitor that the entire time of the procedure. If our doctors need an assistant in certain procedures like exploratories, we go ahead and we scrub in and we assist there. And then after that, we make sure that your pet's waking up good. We make sure that their medications are being given. Uh, we fill any medications that need to be sent home. We get take home instructions ready for that. And then we just kind of monitor them throughout the day feed them, water them, take them outside. And when you come, we go over all that instruction with you and let you know how they did throughout the day. And in between each patient, we go back and we clean the room and we prep and we start all over again. When it comes to dental cleanings, we do the majority of that. So we start by cleaning the teeth. We measure around each tooth to make sure there's no infection pockets. If there's x-rays that need to be taken, we go ahead and do that. And then we fill the doctor in on any problem teeth and then they go ahead and do the extractions. So that's just basically the morning. <laughs> and then after that, it just keeps going on and on. So we do appointment after appointment. We just make sure that we're moving our doctor through each one so that we can see everybody that was you know, scheduled that day or if there's an emergency that came in, we just make sure that we're able to move through each one so we can see you all. So in short, to wrap it up, if you compare us to a human hospital or a human clinic, we, Basically, we're the, sometimes we're a receptionist, sometimes we're the janitor, we're the, you know, the assistant, we're the nurse, we're, you know, the phlebotomist, <laughs> and we're the lab technician. So there's a lot of things that we do. Uh, the things that we can't do is prescribe medication, uh, diagnose, and actually perform the surgical procedures solo. So that's basically all that we can't do. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, everyone. Have a great day.